on the table, it's Lego Mario versus Action Figure Mario. Hey everyone, it's Dan at Squirrel Stampede, and boy, do we have a battle for you today. Who is going to triumph over the ultimate title better than the other Lego Mario versus Action Figure Mario? Let's get right to this. Action Figures of the Likes Mario, Metal Mario, Propeller Mario, Builder Mario, Explorer Mario, Ice Mario, Luigi, Mario with Cappy, Captain Mario, and a Star Power Mario. We begin with Jack's Pacific, Super Mario with Pow Block. I don't know about you, Landry, but I would say Lego Mario will win this round. Yeah, but this Mario has a Pow Block, so I anticipate some good things. I sure do, Landry. Over onto the back of the box, we've got Mario with Pow Block. One of the more later series of Jack Specific's Mario, possibly. They kind of keep recycling these guys. It's hard to tell what is new. Mario with Pow Block. Mario's more than a hero. He is also a talented kart racer, an ace tennis player, a skilled soccer star, a preeminent golf pro, and even a part-time doctor. Now, I would love to see a Dr. Mario in action figure form, large scale. Let's open this Mario and see who wins. I'm pretty sure we've seen this Mario before from Jack Specific Mario with the closed fists in his traditional red and blue overall suit. This one though, oh sorry, this one though coming with a POW block, P-O-W, POW. That's the thing with Jacks. They like to kind of give you the same figure over and over again with one small little accessory. Same thing with Sonic drives me nuts. I see that accessory and I think, did I get this figure before? I get so confused. Anyhow, we've got Lego Mario versus regular Mario. Who's gonna win? Lego Mario goes first. Oh, he burns on Mario and Mario goes for the takedown, oh, but knocks himself out. Must be some sort of cross-timeline pollution. Very interesting start today. The next Mario in store for today, Propeller Mario, Series 3-1. How long have I held on to this one and not opened? On the back of the box, Propeller Mario with coin accessory. This one must be two years back now or more. It's been a while. Let's open up. Propeller Mario out of the box with coin accessory. Uh-oh, Lego Mario also with a propeller feature. So this one has spinning propeller on very large helmet. Look how large the helmet is on this Mario, that's awesome. Red suit with stripe down the chest. What a great Mario figure. Well, who's gonna win this one? I think Lego Propeller Suit Mario won the round, although action figure Propeller Suit Mario is pretty awesome. Next up we have Metal Mario. Have we seen Metal Mario before? I think we have, just in a different packaging. Metal Mario with Trophy Mario is more than a hero, he is also a talent. Okay, we've read all that before. I found this Metal Mario just in the past couple weeks over at Target along with several of these down below. Bowser Jr. looks to come with a bomb bomb now, huh? Alright, let's open and see who wins. Metal Mario out of package. This one is always a spectacular one to find and have. It's so shiny, it's so perfect, it's so solid. I wish it was as heavy. Comes with a little Mario Kart trophy. I can't remember what the previous Metal Mario had, but guess what? I don't believe we saw the trophy before. I'm so confused, I need to go to the archives. But sure, indeed, we did go through a Metal Mario before years ago. I need to do a better inventory. All right, Mario of Lego, who will win Lego Mario versus Metal Mario? There's no identification. Oh, Metal Mario with the major slam hit. Hard to win against Metal Mario, he is just so solid. I think the action figures have a two to one advantage right now over Lego Mario, who's next? Builder Mario is here, Builder Mario, and this another old one, Series 2-6, oldest school packaging. It was so much easier when they did the level series, I was able to tell what and when was new was coming. Metal Mario with belt accessory, nice. 
And to finally open up... And Builder Mario is out! This may be the most detailed Mario figure of the Jack Specific Collection. That added belt and the really nice construction helmet on this guy just really pops. We also have a hammer that fits in his belt. Very impressive! What do you think, Lego Mario? Lego Mario has the Builder suit as well! I forgot! This could be an interesting matchup. What happens when Lego Mario identifies? He thinks Builder Mario is sand. Builder Mario goes for the punch. Not much happening. Lego Mario goes for the kick. And Builder Lego Mario wins. However, Builder Action Figure Mario is just incredible too. Both are really cool looking in this form. So cool to see Builder Mario. Also known as the Mario from Mario Creator Games, right? What do we have up next? Ice Mario! I just found this about a week ago. I was shocked and confused. It was on a great deal, $6.95. Closeout pricing. I was confused though. I could have sworn I saw the blue flower before. I could have sworn maybe opening, but I looked through my collection and I could not find an Ice Mario, so I suppose I never opened. Ice Mario with Ice Flower. When Mario is armed with the Ice Flower power-up, he gains the ability to throw balls of ice that will temporarily freeze his foes in their tracks. Brrrr. Figure with multiple points of articulation. Many of these Marios are basically repaints, but it's so cool to see different forms of Mario with the paint. Let's open up. And Ice Mario out of the pack. This Mario features the open hands. You'll notice that several times you'll either have open hands or Mario with fists. And obviously with Ice Mario we've got red overalls with a blue shirt and a blue hat to feature the ice. Well what do you got Lego Mario? Do you have something to defend against Ice Mario? Oh! Of course he does! He's got the penguin suit! Well, I wonder who's gonna win. Ice action figure Mario goes directly for the face slap. Penguin Mario tries to ID Mario Ice Mario's hat, but turns out nothing. I think Penguin Mario won this one. Oh no, now he's on fire. Oh dear, now he's hurt. Well, maybe it's a tie. Hard to say on that one. Next up, it's Lego Mario versus Luigi, what is Luigi doing in here? How long has Luigi been in this box? Series 2-6 as well, with a mystery block accessory. So I went through my Mario collection and I have discovered I do have a Luigi, but with fists. And also a fire Luigi. Neither one has these open hands of this Luigi. How very odd. And let's open up Luigi and see what happens. And Luigi out of the box, give the crowd a wave, Luigi, as he spins around, giving the crowd, everybody, a wave. Look at Luigi! Wave to Luigi! And pretty much the same Luigi figure, only open hands, I think, and who knows, maybe whoever painted him that day did a few different things, right? So Luigi versus Lego Mario. Everyone, now this is a good chance. I have seen the new Lego Luigi Mario coming out this summer. We've got a couple more months before that release pack, but yeah, excited to see a Luigi in the Lego Super Mario toys. For now, what does Lego Mario think of Luigi? He thinks Luigi's hat is grass, and he knocks him down. It's hard to say if we can count that as a win or not, because this is Lego Mario versus action figure Mario, right? Oh, and then there's that mystery block. I love the little accessories with these. Always so nice. Who's up next? We've got Series 3-1 Mario with Cappy. Ah, finally some Super Mario Odyssey. Another really weathered toy sitting on my back shelf, always wanting to open. Super Mario Odyssey Mario with Cappy, this one, and we'll see how well he kind of compares to the others. I think I see a little more textured detail on those overalls. Let's open up. 
and Mario out of the box and sure enough a lot more detail with this figure I see texture on those overalls and hair this is the first time we get to see Mario's hair ever for me I guess in action figure form well I suppose Lego Mario can do that too oh no it's a hair battle who's got the best hair it's funny how Lego Mario has stud hair coming on studs sticking out and uh, this action figure Mario has a little uh, colic hair sticking out, so a little bit of a hair battle going on. Quickly looking at a regular Mario here, we just opened up, you can see now there is more texture involved on the trousers. The Odyssey Mario's face is very glossy. And also with a one finger pointed in the air number one deal of an Odyssey spin around, yeah. Of course, the finger in the air is also a chance to do the Mario Cappy spin Cappy flip. Oops. Oops. Something like that. It's a great pose. And so now we can place Cappy on top. I don't know how we're going to do it. Do you want the hair sticking out on front? Kind of like that, just kind of sit it. Or do you want to get that hair way in there? Oh, I guess you can't. It's got to be just kind of resting on top, which actually looks good, but won't hold on in a stiff wind. So who will win this one, Lego Mario versus Mario with Cappy? It's probably a Cappy flipping kind of fight, so we'll start with Lego Mario, see if we can do some things. We're gonna just try to flip it. Oh, an action figure Mario with Cappy survives. How about a Cappy attack? And down goes Lego Mario. Cappy Mario with the win. All right, who's up next? But it is Captain Mario. So more Odyssey going on. And a newer package. This was probably, what, a year and a half ago that I picked this up? Captain Mario with red power moon. Outfitted with a captain's hat, Mario is ready to sail the skies on the Odyssey through 17 kingdoms in his quest to save Princess Peach in Super Mario Odyssey. Other figures in this series. Okay, I'm remembering this series now. I did pick up Lakitu who was opened at some point. I can't really remember when. There he is on his cloud. I don't believe I ever found the captured Hammer Brother, though. It feels like I did, but I know I just have a regular Hammer Brother. And we'll see Explorer Mario in just a little bit. Well, Lego Mario, do you think you could take on the Captain? Let's find out. And Captain Mario out of pack, also with the very detailed trousers with this one. So they kept reusing that body, I see. But this one has this amazing captain's hat on, which I believe is permanently stuck. Yeah, that's part of his head. There's no hair underneath. Also with the red moon, and I'm trying to remember what the red moon, how many moons was the red moon. Uh, it's been a while since I've played now but a fun little accessory piece included. So now we have, hey, Lego Mario, you just stole Cappy. How did that happen? There's your hat over here. Now we're back to our correct hats. Who is gonna win this battle? So what does Captain Mario identify as Lego Mario? Hmm, that white hat isn't IDing, so now we're in trouble. Oh, and Captain Mario with the punch. It's not an easy day for you, Lego Mario, is it? Both are very cool figures. Isn't it crazy how many Mario figures I've had just standing by all these years? I've been so meaning to open them, and this one especially. Star Power Mario with probably the most weathered box I've ever seen. I want to say I ordered this off eBay a couple years ago and just kind of completely forgot about it. On the back of the box there, Star Power Mario. There's a couple different Star Power Marios out there. This one with the most of glossy of body. Oh, this was from the Inkling series. I remember Inkling Girl from Splatoon. The way they released those was always just crazy. Well, let's get Star Power Mario finally out of this package because I think it's gonna crumble pretty soon anyway. Oh my, this Mario figure is so trippy. It's so ultra glossy, shiny, weird. I can't even describe what I'm seeing. It's so shiny. It's almost like you take a regular Mario figure and then dip it in thick plastic and then electrocute it with something to really make it sparkle. 
It's like a Christmas ornament or something. It is so sparkly. I don't know how they got that effect with regular plastic. That is incredible. What an incredible Star Power Mario. The previous Star Power Mario that I had picked up was a full body clear Mario. So if you take these two and do a stop motion, you could kind of move them back and forth and they would look like they're flickering. But wow, I'm so glad to finally get this one out and see it. Outside of package, it's even more shiny. Who will win LEGO Mario vs. Star Power Mario? Seems kind of unfair. Star Mario has a star, so we better give LEGO Mario a star. See what happens here. Uh-oh, LEGO Mario has star power music. Do you have star power music, action figure Mario? I don't think so. Watch out. I think LEGO Mario thinks Star Mario is water. Oh, I got some coins out of it. I think LEGO Mario won with the star power. Well, something happened there. But really, when these two clash, I think it's going to be pretty much a draw too. We've seen many a Mario today. Who's next? We have Lemmy Mario. Lemmy, that's not Mario, that's Lemmy. What is Lemmy doing here? I gotta finally open Lemmy, I suppose. Lemmy with magic wand. You may recognize the smallest Koopa Ling by his multicolored hairstyle or the rubber ball he balances on top of, not included. Of course, that's only if you can see past the bombs and balls he's hurling your way with his magic wand. Look out, Mario. And Lemmy Mario out of box. Oh, how adorable. I love the rainbow hair and the wand. Super Mario 3 style. Oh, I didn't know Lemmy had a little tail coming from the back of his hair. And a kind of orange and yellow golden shell back there. What a great little figure. Articulation all over the place and shoulders and knees and ankles. Well, not really knees, like cankles. Oh, Lemmy's so cool. How are you going to defeat Lemmy, Lego Mario? Oh, Mario sends out Larry. That's not Lemmy, that's Larry. So it's Larry versus Lemmy. I see some magic, I see some magic, and... Lemmy wins! Yeah, you can't beat Lemmy. That is one of the coolest. I recall back in the day playing versus Lemmy and the ball. Always fun. All right, I think we're down to our final Mario. It's Explorer Mario. Ooh, with the blue power moon. In Super Mario Odyssey's Wooden Kingdom, Mario can get a special explorer's outfit. It's tailor-made for exploring the deep woods. So many Mario styles today. It's crazy to go through these at once. And opening up. Wow, if we thought that Metal Mario was the most massive, we've got a new team member. This pack on the back of Explorer Mario is super heavy and makes for a very solid Mario figure. He's even making poor Lego Mario bounce when I drop him on the table. Articulated knees, a little bit different because of his coat. His legs kind of come out of his coat and fists and elbows, great face, safari hat. What a final awesome figure for the day. And we've got the blue power moon to go along with the red power moon. Was there a yellow power moon around here? So what do you think? Lego Mario versus Explorer Mario. Lego Mario tries to ID Explorer Mario, but no ID is found. Explorer Mario falls over by his gigantic heavy pack and I suppose that does him in because he's so heavy and Lego Mario can triumph on the kill. But both are terrific. All right, the final results. Where are we at with the numbers? If we include Luigi, the tie, Larry and Lemmy, we're looking like we are all tied up now with Lego versus action figure Mario, which can only mean one thing. It is now time for the Rainbow Toad Smackdown! Blue Toad, Red Toad, and Green Toad here to take on Lego Mario and Action Figure Mario. And wait a second, there's Lego Toad and Lego Toadette for the ultimate of Smackdown battles. On the back of the boxes, Blue Toad with question mark as the primary inhabitants of the Mushroom Kingdom, Toads can be found just about anywhere Mario goes on adventures. 
and will strike down any contest opening up. Who will win the final battle? Lego Mario versus Action Figure Mario versus the Toad Brawl. Fight! Lego Mario goes first. A three down Toad attack. Star Power Mario goes for the flop. Green Toad is enraged and flies at Mario's castle, but completely misses. Blue Toad wakes up and also kind of completely misses bouncing off Metal Mario. Wait a second, Green Toad is okay. Oh, and he takes out Luigi and Captain Mario. Meanwhile, Propeller Mario is causing lots of visual trouble. Red Toad is waking up, but Lego Toad takes him back down, which gives Builder Mario a chance for another takedown. Oh, and he just clobbers him. Meanwhile, while Lego Mario has his back turned, Cappy Mario throws his cap at him. Oh, this enrages Toadette, who then tries to take out Mario by the castle. And she takes like five tries. Lego Mario is back up, but so is Red Toad, Green Toad, and Blue Toad. They just won't go down. The Toads are taking the star power away from Star Power Mario. Oh no, oh no, is this the end? What will Lego Mario and Action Figure Mario do? Well, Lego Mario piles on top and so does Action Figure Mario and... The winner is... Figure Bowser and Lego Bowser have won the contest! Wow! I would have never expected that ending. What a finish! If you like today's video or want to dispute the standings, please give us a squamment and don't forget to squirrelibe and squike. Thanks for watching, that's what I have to say about that.